Moving forward, South African mining company Sibanya Stillwater announced a half-year loss of 7.1 billion rand, attributing it to a write-down of its U.S. palladium operations caused by declining metal prices. The company plans to reduce its U.S. platinum and palladium production by half next year, resulting in approximately 800 job cuts. Now, this decision was made in response to the challenging market conditions that led to the loss. Furthermore, Sibanya recognized a $407 million impairment on its U.S. operations due to a decrease in the palladium price forecast. The company shares rose by 11.21% earlier in the day. Investment research analyst Zimel Mbanjwa provides insights on the situation. So the market is generally pleased by this interim report by Sibanye, not so much for the results, uh, but more so the messaging that came with it, uh, which you'll get to shortly. Uh, but if you look at the numbers, revenue was down 9%, adjusted EBITDA was down 53%, and headline earnings per share were down 98% at the upper end of guidance. Uh, this is mostly because of the depressed uh, com commodity prices, particularly the PGMs. Uh, as well as lower volumes of gold sold, which offset the higher gold price. Now, the market is particularly pleased by the continued uh, restructuring of you know, the PGM operations, particularly in the U.S., uh, where prices of palladium have necessitated further impairments of that asset. So the group will be pulling back production there by up to 2,000 ounces per year to sort of maintain cash flow.